baby. Told you guys we was on to another call. And look at this bad boy, 1970. That's extra bell. That right there is the ultimate street car right there. Huh. Ultimate dream. How you doing today? Hey, bud. How are you doing? Oh, another day in paradise. I'm um, Donald. Nice to meet you, Donald. What's going on with the Chevelle? Can't be nothing wrong with it. Oh, my goodness. The Chevelle. I know, right? Coming home Saturday, uh, last Saturday, it just died on me, and I tried to wouldn't turn it over, so I dug into it, and the, um, the distributor was chewed up pretty bad. Oh, no. Uh, 900 miles on the motor, and I don't want to chance it. It's, it's, huh? It won't fire anyway. Oh, no. And it's got the big block in it? Yeah, it's a 4 l 6 Oh, oh. Not perfect, but uh, I'm working on it. She's well, perfect for I me. I don't ever get it perfect, but I'm trying to get it better. She's perfect the way I see it. Oh, you're very kind. Well, it looks like you want to take it down here to Bikini Drive down to 260? Yeah. Yeah, nice. Nice. Tonight. Yeah. Uh, do you mind if I back in the driveway? No, or? please do. Please okay. do. Let me back in here and grab my car. All right. Oh, baby, you see that car? That would be the car to have right there now. 1970 Chevelle SS with a 454, 455, 454, I'm sorry. Damn, I can't even talk. 454. Big block Chevrolet. The true heartbeat of America. Power. You know, Ford and Dodge and all got their own things, but there ain't nothing beats the heartbeat of America.
How are we doing today? Good. I got Mr. Let's see, Mr. Godsey Chevelle out here. Break. Go out there and talk to uh, Todd. Talk. That's a hell of a speed shop right here. What's going on, bud? I got Mr. Godsey Chevelle out here. Okay. Well, we're going to put it in this door right here. You want me to dump, want me to dump it in here for you, or do you want to push it in? I will push it in. Okay. Yep. About where in that parking lot would it be easier for you to get it? Just anywhere there. Just it's, it's pointed the back the right direction. Just pull up to that bay there. Outside bay on the car wash. Just dump it and we'll push it right in. I got you, bud. Thank you. Yeah, nice performance here in Peculiar. The hell with speed shop. You do a lot of muscle cars. Lots of muscle cars down here.
going on, bud? I don't know where your guy took off to. What do you guys got hiding in the Maverick? Uh, it's not like Ford, but the Pro Charger. But a Pro Charger, huh? Well, they have some of the coolest cars ever down here. I love coming out and see what they're doing. What are we hiding over here? Do I? No Thunderbird. You guys always got the coolest cars down here. That bad boy. Yeah. Look at the SRT. That's got to be the owner's car, ain't it? No. It's Customer's car? Shop, Is it really? Like I said, you guys always got the coolest cars. Woo. A man can move his bed down here and never leave. Later, bud. Yeah. Nice is a little bitty shop, man, but they do some hell of a work in there. Hell of a work. That old, that old, that old, that old uh, SRT in there, boy, wasn't that thing beautiful? My lord. Ah, what would a poor old boy like me do with something like that but get in trouble? Thanks guys, you know what to do, All like right. and subscribe, I'm up here by St. Louis, I think I am, yeah, by St. Louis, I'm going to show you another way I find cars, trucks, this probably ain't going to happen, but I've seen this old truck sitting over on the side of the highway for a little while now, so I'm going to go up here and knock on the door, and see if they think they might be interested in getting rid of it, probably not, but we're going to see. It never hurts to ask anybody, right? Hopefully somebody's here. That's been sent off. Some of them knocking on doors, but I guess you can. Hey puppy. Hey dog. Don't look like anybody here. So what we'll do is I will leave a note. Anyway, I come up here, every time I come up here, this thing's been sitting over on the side of the road. In this yard here with grass growing up around it. And so today I finally stopped in here.
He's got a few vehicles sitting over there. Anyway, we've got to leave a note on the door. It's okay, puppy. I promise. It's okay. It's okay. I promise. I promise. It's okay. I promise. You never know about a dog. Uh oh, somebody's there. You know he does sell. He probably won high dollar for it, but we'll find out. How are we doing today? I was just leaving you a note on your door. Oh, was you? Yeah. You know, it's kind of it's kind of eerie when you walk at people's houses and they're not there. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Especially out in the country. But the reason why I stop for them, I drive up and down this highway about once a month. Right. And I was wondering if you might be interested in getting rid of that old green Chevy truck. That's my son's. No, he won't sell it. He won't come no, off of it. No. It was nine years ago, and he he wanted to fix her back up. We're carburetting it and all that instead of going to the Is it really? Well, I left my note, note okay. number on the door, and if he decides he wants to do something else, you know. Kids anymore, they go from one thing to the next. I'll put you in line. There's a whole bunch of them on it. <laughs> put me at the top of the line. Thank you, my friend. Right, I appreciate man. you. I've been getting eaten up by freaking horse flies trying to fish. That's what hell Oh, is. yeah. <laughs> Mosquito stuff are bad right now. I'm saying, I'm saying, I can't for it, well, you know, we got the heat, and it gets cool overnight, and then flies yeah. and mosquitoes and everything else are kicking it. Yeah, but you know, I see it sitting over in the weeds all summer, and I'm like, yeah, we were going to push it up here yesterday and didn't get a chance. Might do it tomorrow. He needs to come off of it. He don't need it. <laughs> Thanks, bud. Right, man. Be careful. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. You just never know. And when it comes to kids, you know, you never know about that either. And like I said, you got a 50-50 shot. That's just another way I come out by, by finding these cores. Sorry, I was going to show you the truck, but, you know, after he said kind of no, I didn't want to back down the road to where the truck was, but give me a second here. Well, thanks guys. You know what to do. Like and subscribe. I appreciate you.